Hi guys, so in this video um, I'll be covering the difference between Visual Studio Code and Code OSS on the Raspberry Pi. Um, interestingly enough, I mean, they're pretty much exactly the same. I've, I've been coding on Ubuntu, which is on my Dell laptop, for the last year or so with Visual Studio Code. And then when I've started trying to use my Pi more for coding, I found out just so much stuff is either complicated or didn't really work. Um, and this morning in particular I was just losing my mind over getting github to work so for example if you use github with um, VS Code you will know that when you want to add remote for whatever reason on Visual Studio Code that's on the Pi it doesn't work the reason why it, I assume I assume it's some sort of a bug but um, it doesn't work because obviously the Raspberry Pi is an ARM processor and the um, Visual Studio Code is coded by Microsoft and it wasn't designed for that so I noticed this and a bunch of other little fiddly things whereby Visual Studio Code just wasn't working as you'd expect it to work and um, so I'm in my github now if I try and let's just change this test change see if github works Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. So if I commit it all, I mean, it didn't even. Okay, let's save it first. Okay. Commit all and then sync. So usually you'd see a sync thing going on down here. Nothing. Let's just check, anyways. We'll check my GitHub. So 48 prime number loop. Four-year prime number loop. All of them updated two days ago. So I mean, sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. There is another workaround which gets confusing. But instead of doing that, forget Visual Studio Code. Um, it's not not designed to be used in the Pi. Uh, instead, let's get out of that. We'll minimize this for now. Code OSS. Literally, it's the exact same thing as Visual Studio Code. I assume it's a bunch of people that have coded Visual Studio Code themselves and this is designed to work on the Pi so if I go back into my the exact same program oh, this one, which one is it? this one, yeah now, if I, well firstly let's just see if add remote is there see what I mean? It's the, you can see, you can't tell the difference visually They're exact, it's exactly the same but for whatever reason, add remote comes up on code. Well, I know I keep saying for whatever reason, but it comes up on code OSS, but it doesn't come up on Visual Studio Code. Um, and there's just a whole bunch of other bugs like that. So first, let's um, test to see if this gets published to GitHub. And let's save it first. Commit. Even when I, even when I type commit, so many more commands come up. And bear in mind, I have the exact same settings um, on both Code OSS and Visual Studio Code. Um, so commit, then sync. And you can see down there. Look, it's, it's got the. It's telling me it's syncing. Now, if I go to my GitHub, refresh. Twenty-five seconds ago. So what's what's the difference between Code OSS and Visual Studio Code? One was designed for the Pi, the other one wasn't. Um, they're exactly the same. So if you're if you're doing programming on the Pi, um, I'd go with Code OSS. Visual Studio Code might work, but I mean it does. I used it for you know a while, and you can get away with it. But things like GitHub and these kind of issues, you want it to work perfectly. So go with Code OSS. Cool. Alright guys, um thanks for watching and I shall try and stick a link um or I will. I'll stick a link in the description um for where you can get code OSS. Thanks guys, see you in a bit.